Hi, I'm Marita, the executive sponsor of Our United Way campaign this year. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video. Whether you're doing so as a United Way campaign champion, a leader at MidMichigan Health, or a colleague who was simply asked to view this message and you're just wondering how long is this going to take. So here's the deal. Please support the United Way through our workplace campaign. Regardless of our role, none of us would be working here in healthcare if we didn't care about the well-being of those around us. And the people we see around us every day, our patients and visitors, and our coworkers and friends need the United Way. Last year I shared some stats with you, including 78% of all Americans live paycheck to paycheck. So many people are one hole in the roof or car deer accident away from a financial problem. And this one has actually gotten worse. One in four girls and now one in six boys experience sexual abuse or assault by the time they turn 18. Roughly half of school kids experience food scarcity and are eligible for free meals. I will never forget the day I was visiting an elementary school and it was a Monday and on that Monday there had been a two hour weather delay. The kids started arriving around 10 a.m. and pretty quickly meltdown started. These kids were sobbing uncontrollably. Why? Because of the weather delay there was no school breakfast and these kids were hungry more hungry than any other day of the week because they hadn't had much to eat all weekend. And it was after school started having those experiences that programs were created to send kids home with food for the weekend. And lots of those programs received support from the United Way. Now, I could keep going with more stats and stories, but this message is about hope and how we each can make a difference. The United Way studies the needs in our communities and the capabilities of the organizations there to help. With that insight, they direct the money we give to the right places to make the biggest differences. But things don't get better if we don't give. I'm asking you for one this year, one dollar per pay period or one percent per pay period, and I promise you it's doable. When I was a college student at CMU, living on ramen noodles and pot pie, I gave one percent. When I graduated and had my first job truly on my own, my employer said, Marita, Leaders give 1% and more as they grow in their careers. So that's what I did. Honestly, in neither situation was I very happy about it. But truthfully, once I pledged, I didn't miss it. And it positioned me to learn about the United Way and what they did with my money. And I saw the impact. And I've never stopped giving since. At Grash at Mount Pleasant, we say all the time, we're here to take great care of patients, communities, and each other. And I've seen individuals and departments here do extraordinary, generous things for those in need. Here's another opportunity to care for one another. Please give one during our United Way campaign this year. Thank you.